Women wear makeup to hide their flaws, but what I told you, you've been doing it wrong for years. Makeup artist Mally Roncal has the secret to getting it right. Welcome, Mally. Nice to see Thank you. you. Hi, gorgeous. You're gorgeous, you. Hi. You say this secret is going to revolutionize the way that women treat their makeup. Well, yes, this is the thing. So many of us are always like, what colors do I wear? What works with what? And we always tell you, work with your skin tone. And you're like, well, I don't really right. know what my skin tone is. Well, everybody knows what their hair color is. So we are oh. going to work with your hair color to decide what makeup you're wearing. All right, well, let's start with our first model. She is a blonde. Yes. What is wrong with her color choices? Well, let's see. Let's just say there's a lot going on, right? Yeah, there's a, everybody loves a smoky eye. I get it. But those are two big black holes in a bed sheet right there. <laughs> All right? So you really want to make sure you kind of soften it up. So think about peaches, pinks, ambers, all those soft colors. I kind of like what you're wearing. Oh, OK. All okay. right, well, let's bring her out. Come on out, Emma, with her new palette. Clearly done away with the eyes. That's for sure. They look great exactly. now. Exactly. I mean, she's great. She's beautiful. But we just softened everything up. There's again, there's a little bit of that amber tone to the eyes. Everything is very peachy and soft. And then again, let's talk about those lips. A peach lip gloss always looks great with that blonde hair. No matter if you have dark skin or light skin, peaches look great. Good with blonde. Okay, yes. Emma, you look gorgeous. Thank you Thank very you. much. Woo! All right. Okay, now let's take a look at our next model. She has black hair. Yes. What is she doing wrong about her makeup? Well, obviously there's a lot to look at there, right? Yeah, there's again. a lot of color, there's a lot of things, and she's so beautiful. We're going to give you some focus points to look at when it comes to our beautiful Genesis. So okay, you'll see what's so let's happening. see her new palette. Come on out, Genesis. She looks beautiful. Isn't yeah, she yeah, great? Yeah. So again, we took off all the color. I get it, guys. Color's fun. You just don't wear it all at the same time. Okay? Um, you really wanted to focus on the brows. When you Why? have, well, when you have dark hair like this, again, this is a very sort of abrupt stop to the face, right? So when you don't have brows, I always say it looks like your eyeballs are floating out in outer space. Ooh, okay. Yeah, not the look <laughs> not, you're no, going for. Look. So you want to take something like a gray eyebrow pencil, something in a sable color, something that matches your hair color. And that will, again, really frame the face, open up the eyes, make it look like at a facelift, too, which is no bad thing. <laughs> Um, so really, really go for that great brow and then give you a little smoky eye. We use some dark grays and that nude lip is perfect. I love orange lip too, but not with blue eyeshadow. All right, Genesis, <laughs> you look beautiful. Thank, Thank you, you so much. Thank you. Okay, last but not least, the fourth shot of our next model who is a brunette, what is she doing wrong? Okay, well, there, again, this is a lot. There's a lot to look at here. It's all very hard. There's a lot of eyeliner. There's a lot of mascara. There's that white eyeshadow. And she could really play with color. Brunettes can have fun. So think about plums and greens and warm browns, and that can really bring out that beautiful chestnut hair color. Okay, let's see what you did to Melissa. Melissa, come on out. So look how pretty. We went for plum. Okay, again, plums are easy. Think of them as a neutral. They don't have to be super duper colorful. So what we did, we took a little bit of a plum shadow, see pretty colors, mm -hmm. and just did a nice soft blend, gave her a nice soft smoky eye, did a little bit of an orchid to the lip, kept it really monochromatic. So then plum looks natural. It looks really, really fresh. Well, you, they, everybody looks better, much better, obviously, yeah, yeah. after they've had their makeup redone. Come on over here, Thank ladies. Thank you. Come on, girls. And younger. I mean, they're already young, but and, younger exactly. and fresher looking. So that's what it's all about. Softening everything up will make you look ten years younger instantly. Mally, thank you so much. Thank and we you. haven't left out the redheads. Find yes. out what color palette you should be using on our website, MeredithVierashow.com. Again, a big thanks to Mally and to our lovely ladies.